Before this video starts, please give it a thumbs up and share it on Facebook and Twitter and everywhere else, okay? I need the love and support. Keyword, need. What's good, YouTube? It's your man with Mr. Bad Guy, and I'm back on the scene yet again. Yeah, ho! Oh, who is not surprised that Donald Trump won? Honestly, I'm not surprised. I never have been surprised, especially when you know about politics. Now, trust me, I couldn't believe it, but it was like I saw it coming. I mean, come on. If a Democrat has already been president and has had two terms, they're not gonna let another Democrat run behind him. But apparently the Republican Party produced Donald Trump. And in producing Donald Trump, he has no experience of being a president, senator, or whatever. He just a white man. Sorry. Orange white man with a lot of money. And that is something I guess Republicans love, I guess. I don't know. But this is all they had to produce. And it came at a time where people are idiots. I mean, come on now, America. I know you don't want to call you an idiot, but America, I'm sorry. You're an idiot, okay? And your country is so unappreciative of a lot of things. I mean, when Obama came in to try to fix everything that George W. Bush messed up, it was like a man coming in to deal with a woman with six kids and multiple baby daddies and you finally come in and try to be part of a relationship and after eight years, you're like, I, we can't do this, okay? You are an unappreciative woman and I gotta go. These damn kids over here are crazy. You need to fix your kids, man. But that's just the way it is, America. You're very unappreciative. You never cared about certain people. America, you're the biggest racist country I've ever seen in my life. I mean, we could talk about ISIS all day. And I know white people want to say, well, you know what? He's about to bring up slavery. He's about to bring up segregation. Why can't this man, this black person, start letting things go? <laughs> you. We ain't gonna never let that shit go, okay? Until blacks are respected as much as whites are, we will never let anything go. And I ain't gonna let it go. And your white people better quit talking sly stuff to the wrong black person before you possibly get beat up. Cause I ain't gonna lie though, some of you white folks need to get Negan the hell out. I mean Negan, straight up. I, I don't mean no, y'all need Negan. Y'all need to get swapped on your damn foreheads. But reality, Donald Trump is what America really is. Racist white cunts. Now, a majority of you probably say you're not racist and that's your business. And not all white people sided with Donald Trump and I'm not talking about you. You white folks are cool, you know? You understand the problems in America and how it's bothered other races and everything. But this white orange man has said a lot of hateful things. He's done a lot of hateful things. He even talked bad about veterans and you want to talk about that damn football player. And we continue to support a man that disrespected women and all that. America, Donald Trump is you. Now, I don't want to hear no white folks saying we didn't give him a chance because when Obama was in office, all y'all did, and it is a fact, okay? This is not no bull crap or conspiracy. You racist white folks in America showed your asses off, and some of you self hated black people did too. Donald Trump has built his whole career of being a president on hating people who are veterans. He has did some hateful things for the people with different colors and races, and he has. And he also talked about people with handicaps and disrespect women. But you people in America loved it. You people in America ate it up. You people in America decided to go along with this, and this is what we got. I'm not gonna riot. I'm not gonna go and do my marches and all that stuff. I've got a real lot of white friends, like, you know. And I don't hate Donald Trump. I'm not mad at him. But his supporters, you people are sick, okay? Please subscribe, rate, leave a comment. It's your man with Mr. Bad Guy. Peace. I'm out.